Outside so many Indian airports are scammers trying to get you to cancel your hotel reservations. And they'll do this by telling you some lies like your hotel is in a super dangerous area. So many bad things have happened there or you know, the owner is a bad, bad person. Or a famous one is the hotel has burnt down like, like this one behind me and sometimes hotels do burn down here. But 99% of the time when these guys are using that, that line it's, it's just total, total rubbish. And usually it's taxi drivers doing this, but here in Srinagar, it's houseboat touts trying to get you to come to their houseboats because there are so many houseboats all around here. And yeah, there's so much competition, so they're waiting for you at Srinagar Airport. Check it out. I'm outside the airport now and I'm so happy to be greeted by this Jammu and Kashmir police officer whose job it is to look after foreigners. That is until this tout arrives. And just listen to me bait him and how quickly he'll lie. Hi. You're good, thank you. Yeah. Uh, shelter Heritage Hostel? Shelter Heritage Hostel. Why so? Someone told me it's okay. Huh? Someone told me it's good. You are in Kashmir and a paradise. Yeah, I know. Somebody pick up the gas house. You somebody pick up? No. You go to the Pupi taxi counter. Okay. Hey, my dear, you are not here to be in a guest house, hotel or something like that. What? If you are getting free accommodation there, then it's okay. Huh. Otherwise, you are on a holiday. Yeah. You are cheating your holiday. Why? You have to be in an open lake where you have a fresh air, fresh mm -hmm. air, trees, mountains mm -hmm. before you. Yeah. So, that's not fair you are going to get. Is there a better hotel? Yes. Oh. Houseboats are better than hotels. Houseboats are better. Better. And it's just like a homely company. Ah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Can I show you one? You will really, you will, you will enjoy your fun holiday. Where you come from? New Zealand. Then you, nobody told you about the houseboat. No. Oh they, my they, God. They told me, but this hotel looks good. Uh, looks no, like a nice hotel. Do you know this hotel? Yes. Hotel yes. Heritage Hostel. Heritage, I know, but that is not for you because oh. you have all been been staying houses, guest houses, uh. and hotel. So is the owner bad or? Uh, to a certain extent, yes. Really? Things have happened there? Yeah. What happened there? Oh, many things. Don't make me worry. Yeah, many, many things. Sir. Really? After departure, cheating and all that. Really? Oh, no. oh but houseboats is not the, no. it's safe. It's a, it's a, who said? Houseboats are actually home away from home. Oh, really? They give, they give a family atmosphere. Yeah. Ah, no, the man has to go to the side of the man. Hello, sir. Yes, sir. We are going to Royal Heritage. Yes, sir. You go to Protect Pupi Taxi Counter, sir. Thank you. What's wrong with this guy? No, sir. You go to Protect He's not good. No, I am good. Come, 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 sir. Hey, Bumbara, Pali. Hey, Pilas. Come. Yeah, we are going to the hotel. Yeah, we are going to the hotel. Come, come. Hey, Yaz, go to the hotel. Actually, sir. Shukriya ji, my mere dost aa raha hai. So, yes, sir. I just wanted to see what this guy wanted to say to me. Your name, mobile number, sir? Yeah. Your dost, sir. Yeah. So, he is going to meet double me by this flag, double I think. Double eight. Two five zero, two five zero. Yes. Five three five three, five three five three. He's calling. So. You can meet him, he's there. Come. Hi Shamim, I'm coming. I'm by the prepaid taxi counter. Okay. Thank you. Okay, this guy is coming to pick me up. Okay. Right now. Okay, goodbye. Hello sir, please wait for about 15 minutes. Okay, thank you.
Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Shamim. Good to see you after so long, bye. How, how are you? Very good, very good. How was your journey? Awesome. And so I was just filming a scam video out there. Uh -huh. And yeah, like I thought, as soon as I exited the airport, a guy inside the airport came up to me okay. and tried to get me to come with him and get into a taxi. Uh -huh. And then when I got outside the airport, uh -huh. another guy tried to come and sell me and tried to tell me to get on a houseboat okay. and tried to tell me that the hotel that I was going to was not good. Okay, okay. And so, <laughs> yeah, I was just, just filming this scam mm -hmm. just to help people. And so that cop got really worried because uh -huh. he saw me talking to these guys uh -huh. and he was like, oh, no, 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 don't do this. <laughs> so he wanted to call you. No, I, I already called the hotel you have uh, booked already. Yes. I called them. They are really waiting for you. They, in fact, they were ready to send you the car. <laughs> I told them, no, I know Carol from a long time. I am going to receive him. Yeah. He is with me for whole day. Yeah. And in the evening, maybe at 4 or 5 o'clock, we will reach you. Yeah, awesome. So guys, don't trust people even inside the airport. They're trying to earn commission off you. They're gonna take you outside and try and pawn you off to another taxi driver and take like, I don't know, 20, 30% commission rather than taking you to the prepaid taxi booth where that police guy was telling me to go. Rightfully, he was telling me to go and I'm so glad that Jumbo and Kashmir has tourist police looking after people outside that airport. And that tourist police, he saw what was happening to me. He saw that the guy was trying to tell me the hotel was was wrong and then I should go and stay somewhere else and try and cancel my reservation so yeah thank God for that guy so don't believe anybody and especially when you get outside the airport it's even worse people will try and tell you your hotel is bad that it's not safe and they'll just try and tell you any kind of lie to sell you their hotel or their houseboat or whatever never go off these guys because they're gonna take you to the worst place and just try and earn so much commission from you so when booking hotels here in India do not just turn up and trust some guy on the side of the street, some tout or some taxi driver. Make sure you check reviews online and book yourself because if you go with these touts on the street, they're just like their goal is just to extract as much money from you as possible and take you to bad hotels so they can mark up as much as possible. And also, one other thing, do not trust these hotel counters at the airports, especially here in Srinagar. So these hotels whether they're scam or not, as long as they have enough money, they can pay for a kiosk inside the airport. So it makes them seem like legitimate. But I've heard so many horror stories about some of these hotels which have brought these kiosks. So yeah, be very wary of those as well. Check your reviews. And if you want to travel safely and confidently here in India, check out my quick start safety guide at indiasurvivalguide.com. Go and check it out now.